What's up guys? Today I have an unbagging and a quick look at a pair of unbranded Indigo Selvage denim in the skinny fit. Let's go ahead and check it out. Alright, so inside we have the invoice. I picked these up $68 shipped. And then the denim itself. So, I actually picked these up for my brother. As you, some of y'all might know, he picked up some Naked and Famous Elephant 2s back in January. Unfortunately, he decided not to keep them. Uh, they were still a little too uncomfortable for him, even after a month and a half of wear. And decided that they were a bit too heavy for SoCal. So if you guys didn't know already, I own and still occasionally wear a pair of unbranded selvage denim myself. Wore them pretty religiously for about two years, but they've been long retired now. For those curious, I currently wear some Urban Outfitter house brand BDG Selvage Skinny Denim. I picked them up for $30 off their sales rack a couple months ago. Really cheap denim. Uh, some might actually consider it a waste of time, but I like the fit, and I'm curious to see how they turn after two years themselves. So my very first YouTube video that I uploaded was my review of my own unbranded Indigo Selvage denim at a 22-month point. Uh, go ahead and check it out if you're interested. So at my recommendation, and also at a much lower price point, I was able to convince my brother to pick up a pair of unbranded indigo selvage denim himself. So today, we're going to do a quick look at the brand new pair, and, do some, and then do some comparison between this death sock pair and then my own personal pair at two years old. Alright, so on to the actual denim. Here's the bag that it came in. Unbranded skinny selvage. Uh, the model is UB101 Indigo Colorway. For those that don't know, Unbranded is actually the sister company of Naked and Famous. So even at around $70, the quality is definitely nothing to scoff at. Go ahead and take it out of its bag. You get a nice, stiff, raw denim. Here in the skinny fit, size 29. Large, blank, leather patch up top. No design anywhere on the back pocket. There's a little pull-out paper here. Basically, it's unbranded's concept. Uh, you know, no branding, no washes. Just a nice, clean, simple design. But an all-rope tie, selvage denim. So it's got a pretty long 36-inch inseam. If we cut the bottom, we can see there, blue ear selvage. So all around is a contrasted gold, copper-like uh, contrasted stitching, <coughs> shiny copper uh, hardware, button fly, and even some hidden rivets at the back, just for more durability. There's a little tag back here, skinny fit. 14.5 ounce selvage denim and just to put this in relationships to uh, to other denim the naked and famous elephant 2 are uh, 22 ounce uh, these are 14.5 ounce selvage Levi string to fits are around 12.5 then regular Levi's are maybe around 9 ounce and then the jeans with you know the stretch such as lycra or spandex those are even more lightweight at around 6 or 7 ounce and the weight basically refers to how much a yard of this fabric would weigh. We got a care guide underneath. Basically, it's telling you to wear it for a few months or until it gets dirty, and then give it a wash. This is made in Macau. So yeah, if you guys have any questions at this point, go ahead and send me a message or leave a comment. Right now, we're going to go through how this compares to my two year old pair. Okay, so let's see them side by side. Mine on the left have been worn for two years. Dead stock pair on the right hand side. Leather patch, back pockets. Mine on the left, uh, I had a hole at the crotch that had to be repaired around 18 months in. Down the legs to the combs. They fit it very well. Um, nice contrasted color. 
and the cuffs. Let's go see what the front looks like. Nice to find whiskers, cell phone fade. Okay, down to the knees. Nice knee fades. And then to the cuffs. Overall, I'm very happy with my pair. I'm super excited to see how my brothers turn out. If you guys have any question, whether or not it's about denim care, you know more about cheap entry level denim about unbranded denim in general whether or not questions regarding how it is out of the bag or how it is after two years of wear go ahead and send me a message or leave a comment right down below like comment subscribe peace